Hey, I'm Dixie Agostino with Switchgear Search and Recruiting, and today we're at video six of our Step Up Your Hiring Game video series. And what we're doing today is we're creating our hiring team. Previously, we talked about our scorecards and our metrics and what needs to be done and why we need to have a consistent process. Now we're putting that into action. So the best shape of our hiring team is going to be a triangle for this reason. It is provides a lot of stability with as minimum people as possible because we don't want to waste our employees' time. Time is money. Um, so the three people that we need involved in our hiring team or our hiring panel is the manager. This one is actually by far the most important for this reason. People accept jobs, they sign on to companies, they quit bosses. So if there's not a strong chemistry, uh, if there's not a workability, if there are personality conflicts between even the best performer and their boss, you're not going to retain that person. Um, the second most important is the culture, the culture piece. This is really a buffer to make sure that uh, hey, as management, a lot of times we tend to get tunnel vision or we really like people that are like us. So this is the person who makes sure um, that we're not missing any signs, that we're seeing everything and that this person is going to be an ideal um, and seamless fit into our culture, that they're going to believe the values that we believe. Um, and they're also kind of filtering um, for hey, maybe we're just hearing what we want to hear, so this person is in place to eliminate that. Um, and then the third person we need on our team is the technical expert. The more technical the position, the more we need a technical expert, um, especially in, um, in a position where we have uh, engineering or accounting or IT, someone where if you don't actually know the technical skills, we don't necessarily have time to time to train. You got to know this. We're hiring you because you know how to do this. So let's, this is a vetting process. Um, so what we're going to talk about in our next video is the interview process. And the reason one of the other benefits of having this hiring team is because all of these people can come from the same unit if they're hiring into their team and they'll all have buy-in. Um, although this, some of these pieces can be filled from outside of the unit in which the candidate is going to work. But really what we're trying to do is uh, there's an idea I got from Ryan, Ryan Holmes, he was the CEO of Hootsuite, and he said that one subpar employee can send an entire team into disarray. And what ends up happening is that um, teammates end up wasting their time training someone who doesn't have a future with the company. So we're trying to eliminate the, that cost, the cost not only of uh, paying someone to do a job that they're not doing well, but the cost of our team putting an investment into that person who's not going to cut the mustard. Um, so if this information is good for you, um, reach out to us at info at switchgearrecruiting.com. We can take it to the next level um, by doing a hiring process audit and seeing where else you can find efficiencies and improvements to really make your hiring process pop, um, which can honestly give you gains and efficiency of 15 to 50 percent because you're hiring the top people. Um, so hope that helps and join us for our next video where we're going to be talking about specifically the interview process that we need to put in place.